Hi everyone, in this video I will show you how I made the texture for, th for these slashes and uh, how I made uh, this uh, side smoke. This is what uh, the fire slash texture looks like. I will create the same. Just use pen tool to make the similar figure. Make a selection and use a fill tool. After that, add a new layer and uh, create uh, such random figures uh, just by using uh, darker color. After you finish, click on the first layer uh, using Ctrl, then uh, invert selection, just use Ctrl Shift uh, I, select the layer with lines and press delete. After that, add a new layer as a mask and uh, make uh, some parts brighter. After you finish, combine all uh, layers into one and uh, use Ctrl click on this layer. Then uh, use gradient tool to make, uh, uh, make a gradient using your, co your colors. For example, I uh, make uh, beginning of the slash lighter and the ends of the, of the slash darker. Then use linear light to make uh, such an interesting effect. And uh, then use uh, color gradient to make, uh, to, to make your colors. After you finish, combine all these uh, layers and use uh, liquify filter. This is uh, the main part. After you finish, select uh, this layer and uh, use uh, outer glow and uh, you can use black background uh, to better see uh, the results so just add this uh, small outer glow just uh, with radius one and uh, save it without black background after importing this texture to Unity, create shader with uh, dissolve noise. You can use a any noise for dissolve, just uh, uh, find that uh, fits perfect. In my case, I use uh, such noise, then uh, add uh, some moving for the noise, add uh, the second noise for distortion and uh, that's how I made this slash. Also I will show you how to make uh, noise for distortion. It's quite simple. Just create a new texture, use uh, clouds and uh, create uh, one black cute, use clouds again and uh, select the best filter for it. Also, you can use uh, flames uh, like this using the same technique. Uh, the same for, uh, for example, for water slashes. But uh, all the same, but uh, different color. Uh, to do this, uh, just uh, use the same technique as uh, for fire slash. Um, you can uh, do it quite simply just draw some random figure make a selection uh, copy it uh, and uh, use liquid fire filter again uh, 
and uh, it's better to have, for example, uh, four figures to make uh, effect uh, more random and uh, use it uh, in your effect. Also, some of my subscribers uh, asked me uh, how I made uh, these uh, borders. So, it's uh, one uh, mesh for background. I used uh, back-sided material, one uh, front-sided uh, mesh, and uh, it just uh, it just uh, a gradient. But uh, with uh, uh, UV distortion, distortion like uh, like this, and uh, with uh, uh, opacity multiplied five times, but with uh, saturation. And uh, these are black borders because of uh, opacity. Now I will show you the shader. Because uh, this is the only way to explain how I made these borders transparent. It's only one check button, soft borders. If I click it, I, made, I make borders transparent. It's just uh, this group of nodes. So that's all for today. Thanks uh, for everyone who likes and dislikes my videos and uh, writes comments. And uh, goodbye.